When terrorists attacked our country on 9-11, many of us experienced a number of emotions, anger, confusion, frustration. And there seemed to be this universal desire to want to do something, anything to help many of us fulfill that desire by donating blood. Donating blood. Donating blood. Robbie Rappish is spokeswoman for the Blood Bank of Delmarva. Robbie, thank you so much for coming in today and, and, and joining us. Got some great information here. And I think one of the things we want to hit is, is the outpouring of donations spoke such volumes. People wanted to do something, anything, to feel that they could make a difference. I mean, we felt so incredibly powerless. And there were, was a huge pouring out at all four donation centers across Delmarva. And they say donating blood is, is, is donating, it's the gift of life. It is. And, and also a great way to honor the people who did lose their lives 11 years ago. Well, if, I think that if, especially if you believe that the best revenge, you know, is to live well, to help up to three people live well out of a blood donation um, is very, very sweet. Uh, you can break a blood donation down, a whole blood donation down into three components. It can save up to three people. Um, it's vital vital that people donate blood. I'm, can you tell I'm a little passionate yeah, a little, about it? Yeah. Just a little. It's been a long time since I've been talking about it. So explain just a little bit more about that. It can, a little bit of blood can go a long way. It can, a very long way. Um, but blood only sits on a shelf for up to 42 days, if it sits that long, because most blood that's donated is used pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. um, but you can only donate every 56 days. So there's a gap. And if we don't continue to fill that gap, when the blood you know, it needs to be replenished, the hospitals call every morning. You know, 9-11 was, was an interesting situation. Hospitals call every morning and, to their blood bank and they say, we need this, we expect this many surgeries, we expect this much in the ER. Well, what happened on 9-11 was initially nobody knew how many people would be injured. And so people poured out to give blood thinking there would be this tremendous need. And then there wasn't. I mean, there were only, you know, survivors to a certain degree. There were people who were injured trying to leave Manhattan, trying to leave the Pentagon. They all needed blood, but um, at some point, every blood uh, facility had to say, enough. Hmm. Um, blood Bank of Delmarva is unique in the fact that you're a member, and so we call you to donate about every 18 months. So you schedule an appointment. So we were able to turn to our members and say, we understand that you're standing in line. Um, we're happy to take your blood today, but you might want to wait, because if you wait a week, that puts blood on the shelves one week further. Right, right. Who can donate blood? Um, you have to be in generally good health. That's very important. Uh, you have to be 17 or old, over 17. You need to weigh 110 pounds. Um, I always have such a problem with that. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, and no tattoos or body piercings within a year. So mm -hmm. if you have a tattoo, it's not that you can never give. Um, right. You just have to wait a year and then you can give. Um, and you need to have a photo ID. You said something about making an appointment. Yes. You do. How you do want, we do that? Well, you can go to the Dom, uh, to Blood Bank of Delmarva's website, okay. or you can uh, make a phone call, very simple one, at 1 888 8 Blood 8, and that will take you to the scheduling folks who are happy to make an appointment for you when you can come and where you can come, whether it's at one of the four stationary facilities, one of which is in Salisbury. Right. There are more than 30 mobile unit stops all over Delmarva. Um, some that are coming up are Lewis and Rehoboth and Easton and Federalsburg. We will come to you. Um, you tell us where you are and we'll tell you when we're going to be there. Great information, right. Robbie. Thank you so much. Thank you so, for having me. We want to continue donating blood. And if you would like to make an appointment online to donate blood, go to DelmarvaLife.com and click on the show tab. Still ahead on our special 9-11 Delmarva Life. The incredible story that inspired one local artist to write a song about 9-11. We'll be right back.